heard a bang. It was a, the bang was just awful. She knows not to go out of the gate. It's not going to be destiny. And I think I heard someone saying it's destiny, but I wasn't having it. And I saw a little girl underneath the car, but I was looking for Destiny's dress. And I got a, for that split second, I got a sense of relief because I couldn't see Destiny's dress. And then I looked over and I saw Destiny. And there she was on the verge, just lifeless. I actually thought she was dead. Uh, Destiny had a bleed to the brain, a hit to the frontal lobe of the brain. She had multiple body injuries and fractures and broken bones. Lacerated kidney. I just wanted my baby girl to stay alive. Alan greeted us, a real compassion he gave off. Oh, Alan. He spoke at the right time. All I remember him saying is, everything's going to be OK. I've got a room for you. He brought us to this house, and I was, didn't know what to expect. And wow, it's like home. It was like home be able to make toast. Yeah, well have this is how at home I feel. I have yeah. my slippers. I do not know how I would have managed traveling every day. Oh, remember like that. With their dark eyes. It's the day before, you never know oh, what the next day is going to bring. My mum stayed for three weeks. I was very, uh, because I had no release in the hospital. I didn't have no release. I had to be strong and brave and focus and help my daughter because she was like a baby again. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. So, just little things that make a difference. Because when you're in the situation, you, you don't even want to get washed and dressed, you just want to be. But this took you away that you had the stuff here that you had to get washed and dressed and keep yourself healthy, to be healthy for your child. Being close to my daughter was the most, most important thing. That place, that rest, that bed keeps your sanity. Yes. Love that and Mister. It's your go again now? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you haven't been yet. <laughs> yeah. We should have this I now can go back and say I understand why Alan said everything will be okay. It covers so much. Just to have somewhere that we can come and open the door, sit on the bed, talk, cry, sleep, go through all them emotions. It's an amazing gift to have.